hello friends in this video i will be making you learn some of the recent nb type physiology questions so i will be skipping some of the easy questions and emphasizing more on some of the difficult question or the rare question so starting with easy the normal tidal volume is 500 ml normal residual volume is 1200 ml air remaining in lungs after normal expiration is functional residual capacity dorsal root ganglion contains body of sensory neurons you may get confused that which part of sensory neuron so it is the body of the sensory neuron not the dendrites of the sensory neuron it is the body of the sensory neurons which the dorsal root ganglion contains now normal anion gap metabolic acidosis is seen in so it is seen in rta renal tubular acidosis then other are the diarrhea and some of the operations like not operation some of the conditions like fistula gt tube drainage and etc co2 diffusion occurs readily because of high solubility of the carbon dioxide now thyroid hormones are transported into the cells by this is a new question which you will find difficult to answer during the exam so you have to remember it as mtc8 thyroid hormones are transported into the cells by mtc8 full form is written here so and uh, for thyroid hormone to be transported in brain it is oatp1c1 then true about insulin is among these options only c is correct that a and b are connected by c peptides and the b chain contains 30 amino acid while the a chain contains 21 amino acid combinedly insulin is made of 51 amino acids it's a very basic question you should know this then movement of substance prevented across the intercellular space by so it is zona occludens the same question but the options are different it is here it will be tight question tight junctions then most important intracellular cation is potassium type of collagen present in cornea is type 1 now this question is being repeatedly asked in recent nb type of exams at the type of collagen present in different tissues and <coughs> and the body parts so you you can go through the kalam appendix to know the different types of collagen present in different tissues very important where you cannot miss this then visual processing center is located on the occipital lobe ecg is rhythm in full full awake and alert state it is beta rhythm chemical messenger acting at long distances endocrine is easy <coughs> then high anion gap metabolic acidosis is seen in renal failure you can rule out the option rta is normal metabolic acidosis diarrhea is normal metabolic acidosis then maturation of b cell takes place in bone marrow which of the following is secondary lymphatic organ it is spleen most prominent action of <coughs> angiotensin 2 is vasoconstriction this is important question most important action of angiotensin 2 is vasoconstriction normal pulmonary artery pressure in mmhg is 15 mmhg cephalic phase of gastric secretion is caused by parasympathetic stimulation now this is to be revised from your physiology section different phases of gastric secretion of which cephalis cephalic phase is caused by parasympathetic stimulation bilateral dam damage to the lateral hypothalamus causes it's a very important and rare question which you get which you will get confused in during the exam so it causes anorexia <coughs> not the increased sexuality bilateral damage of lateral hypothalamus causes anorexia isovolumetric contra contraction is seen in anti gravity muscles increased ventilation at the start of exercise is due to proprioceptors now there are three different questions uh, of which you can see it is written at the start of exercise now increased ventilation at the start of exercise is due to proprioceptors increased heart rate just before starting exercise is due to in release of adrenaline and rapid <coughs> increase in heart rate at the start of exercise is due to proprioceptors so don't get confused in question number 9 10 the 11 the 9 is about increased ventilation so increased ventilation at the start of exercise is due to proprioceptors now for increase in heart rate there are two type of things if it ask just before the starting exercise then it is the release of adrenaline and if it ask at the start of exercise or just after starting the exercise it will be proprioceptors at 
as proprioception means in the receptors to detect joint movement and it will only detect if the exercise is happening or at the start of exercise and not just before the exercise because before the exercise you are not moving your joints and so it will be due to release of adrenaline increase in heart rate just before will be adrenaline and increase in heart rate at the start of exercise will be proprioceptors then pericytes are seen in capillaries and post capillaries venules